What's your story? What's your sign? It's like we're twin flames in a different life Deep connection, lights a spark It's like you know me in the depths of my heart We're dreamers Hi guys, welcome back to the second part of our trip to Royal Leamington Spa. Thanks for joining us. So the park up you just saw is on Park Flight. I'll let you do a little bit of homework for yourself and uh, you can find that. It's quite easy to find because it's right beside the River Leam. Um, Sue lost her fin. So if she looks like she's not too stable on the board, um, that's the reason why she's uh, got a new fin now, so uh, she can paddle straight in the future. You went in. No, no, nearly. Nearly took my eye out on a branch. Come he normally just jumps, what's wrong with him? Well, it's the rivers, so there shouldn't be no, um, there's no legal thingy to say Light you can't out. go past. Maybe it's just ire boats, because they do ire boats down there. So if you're wondering what we're talking about, there was a sign on the bridge, um, and it said no boats beyond this point, and we was a little bit confused, uh, but it doesn't apply to paddle boards. There's an ire shop just down the road, and it applies to the boats that they rent out. So, uh, yeah, you can paddle where you like on the river, basically. At this point along the river, Sue comes across two big swans yeah. guarding its baby, and uh, she wasn't too keen to go Will first. Will you be bothered by them? They won't attack you. So one of the reasons we uh, made a video about this stretch of the river is because of how easy it is, the accessibility for it um, from a van, how beautiful it is, and uh, also um, it's a little bit challenging, as you can see, by the overhanging trees. And uh, yeah, all the way along the river, it's, it's really pretty. So uh, it's well worth a paddle. You have to get a bit of speed up to go these, babe. Wait, Zeb. Come here. Come here. Zeb the Border Collie realises he's got to swim past the swans and doesn't really fancy yeah. it and uh, decides he wants to come on board as well. Right, yeah. Stay. No, stay. 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 Stay down, Dill. Dylan, lay down. <laughs> you see at this point, the swans were being quite threatening and uh, causing quite a bit of a bottleneck <laughs> no one else was uh, right. brave enough to go past them yeah the wind is going against us so it will be harder going well it'll be harder going back Ooh. are you trying to knock me off <laughs> Did he jump in? Go on. Wow. 
Well, filming is more important than the uh, making sure you're okay, isn't it? It's fine. It they put filming, the, um, the suntan oil lotion. The, the water's just dripping off me. So Zebby jumped in, capsized you, or turned you over. Typical. If it isn't a kid, it's the dogs. Is it cold? No, it's all right. Actually, it's nice. Is it? Yeah. You say that because you've been in. <laughs> no, it's nice. <laughs> it's not as bad as the Lake District. That was freezing. Don't you dare. No. You chose to get in the water and I stay in the water. No, it's actually all right. Could have been worse. Could have had clothes on. Could have been. Right, so we're on the river Lean, I believe, is it? Yes, I think it's Lean. Lean or Lean? Lean. Is it Lean? Lean, I think we've been in Lean. Have you seen it? It's, uh, um... Have you seen it? Yeah. Um, yeah, I can see you. Where are we? Um, Lemington Spa. Lemington Spa. And we've gone... Is this upstream? This must be upstream, isn't it? Because if the weir is that way, it's flowing that way, so... I'm not sure. It's quite pretty, isn't it? It is, yeah. We're going to have to get past this bit, though. Yeah, we've got a little narrow in it. It'll be interesting. Let me go first, and then we'll catch up on this. Paddles, that's too long. We're going to be going for a bit of a jungle weir. No, this way, do. You want to mention your potential name change? Yeah, I've been thinking about changing the name of the channel. Um, so, if you have got any good names, um, put them in the in the comments below, and I'll consider them. But the possibility is Rhodes Home. Shall I say it in English? Um, yeah, Sue's going to say it in English. Rhodes Home. That's what I just said. Rhodes Home. <laughs> so yeah, that's a. I think that's a good name. Um, it's a, a. It's definitely a little bit more quirky than what Mark. Yeah, but the Mark T five ninety was a quick name because very, um... the the story behind the Mark T five ninety name is um, myself, Graham, um, wonder sometimes. Sometimes I wonder. Whichever one it is, I keep getting it wrong. Sometimes Graham, you've got to change your name. It's a bloody pain in the ass that name. Sometimes, sometimes I, I sometimes I wonder. Wanda, Wanda. What is he doing? I don't know. Whatever it is. Oh. Anyway, me, Graham, and Ian, so Captain Chaos, um, was up in Scotland, and it was in the the first lockdown. And one night we decided that we should start a YouTube channel between. Oh, we, we considered doing it between the three of us, a sort of like a, a Top Gear series of three guys and a camper van um, type thing. Um, but that would be difficult because Ian lives in... Um, I'm in London. Ian's up in the far northwest. And Graham is all over the place really, but was originally from Hull or around that area, mid Middle England. Did you just say Hull? Hole. yeah so yeah we decided we'd, we'd start up a, um, a YouTube channel so we, the, the challenge was that we'd we'd do our own channels and see who got where um, so yeah if you want to help me win the, the the challenge between us three guys subscribe wait do you um, get an advantage now because you've got me um, they might disqualify you. it might be a disadvantage <laughs> 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 Wait, <laughs> don't you dare push me go in now. Um, well, that's that is to to find out, isn't it? Um, is it going to be an advantage? We, we will find out um, in the future if, if I have a sudden flux of subscribers <laughs> or a sudden dip. <laughs> or a sudden dip. <laughs> yeah, um, the story will be told. Um, yeah, so that's how the sometimes um, the 
Mark, Mark 2590 came about. It was just a quick name. And at the time I did consider Rhodes Ohm, um, which I'd sort of prefer myself because it has like a, a double meaning. Road being home and the road home back to where you came from. So, or where you're going. Or where you're going, yeah. And wherever I'm going, I take my ass with me. So it's sort of, um, it has got a double meaning to it and I, I quite like that theme. So yeah, there, there might be a change of channel name. So if, if, you, if you've subscribed and there is a sudden change of name, that would be the reason why. Um. Whatever you do guys, don't get old and lose your spirit for adventure and fun. Everything that you do in life doesn't have to cost a lot of money. Um, we've had a couple of days of really good fun and it's uh, pretty much cost nothing um, other than buying the pedal boards. Living in a van is uh, a cheap way to live and for most people they do it because they haven't got a lot of money. Um, I do it by choice and uh, yeah yeah I just want to prove that um, having fun um, messing about and uh, having a good time doesn't need to cost you a fortune you can do it on pretty much nothing one thing I love about Sue is that she hasn't lost the childish attitude she hasn't grown up don't ever grow up guys Sunday, unfortunately. What does Sunday mean? Another day that I have to return to work tomorrow, to drive back to London, and another day comes to an end. Another video comes to an end. I've actually got work tomorrow as well, so that's good. Well, it's good. good the fact that I get some money, but not good that I've got work. Okay. Yeah. Well, I guess the only reason we both work is because we need the money to live. So yeah, the end of the video. Then the and, uh, yeah, it's not just uh, an end of a day for us. Uh, it's the end of a video for you guys. And another goodbye. And another goodbye, yeah. Um, I've enjoyed the weekend. So have I. And hopefully these guys have enjoyed what we put together. Well, bodged, actually, bodged, bodged together. What you put together, yeah. and the ramble from and me, your contributions, my epic, yeah. wonderful contributions, especially getting wet. Because no doubt you're going to put that bit in. Your bit where you fell off the board. The bit where I won't, I was, I won't mention it. I won't mention that. No. The bit where I was kind of pushed, really, by the dog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So uh, thanks for watching again. Um, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. You've probably heard it a million times before. Maybe I shouldn't even tell you anymore. Um, and I'll see you on the next one.